Hello, I'm Cam Johnson, Public Affairs Manager for Cox Communications, and I'd like to welcome you to the August episode of Across the Gulf Coast. We have another great show in store for you today. We have a lot of new organizations coming on the show, and we're going to learn about everything they do for our community and some of the great events that they are hosting here up and down the Emerald Coast. Uh, the first is Our first segment is with a, a new organization that is new to the show, not new to the area, but new to the show. Uh, it's Opportunity Place, located here in Fort Walton Beach. And joining me now to talk about Opportunity Place and a great event that they have coming up are Deborah McDaniel and Lee Wetzel. Thank you both so much for coming on the program Thanks. today. Thanks Thank for you. having us. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, Deborah, let's start with you uh, as the Executive Director for Opportunity Place. Tell us a little bit about Opportunity Place and what your mission is, what you guys do for the community. Thank you so much I, for the opportunity to come and talk with you. Absolutely. We are a shelter. Uh, we work with families and single women. Um, the shelter is really a tool that we use to help stabilize these families. They're homeless. Um, again, it could be somebody who's chronically homeless, but it could also be somebody who's just run into a hard time. And we help to stabilize them and then to focus them on getting into housing. That's our really our priority. How do people uh, get referred to you? How do people uh, come to Opportunity Place? What does that process look like? We have a very good reputation in the community. Mm -hmm. We serve both Okaloosa and Walton counties, and so we may get referrals from other organizations, uh, churches, uh, the police officers or sheriffs, so mm -hmm. there's a lot of different ways. We do have a waiting list. We're a somewhat small shelter in mm -hmm. that we have 10 rooms, uh, but a family, when they do come to us, they get to stay together as a family unit. In fact, that's one of the things that's more exciting about sure. what we do. Um, and a perfect example is we have a father who is with us who was able to be reunified with his kids because he was at our shelter. I'm sure that's a great experience, not just for the family, but for you guys as well to, to see Absolutely. that when that takes place. Uh, Absolutely. Uh, hopefully you all have a lot of great success stories. We uh, do. We've shelter. had last year, we were able to serve over 270 people. And keep in mind, we're only talking about 10 rooms. Mm -hmm. um, and. It, that was about 11,000 sheltered nights. So you might ask, what do I mean by that, right? So basically, a sheltered night, it means those were nights that people weren't living in their vehicles or living on the streets, in the woods, or maybe couch surfing from house to house. So uh, being a nonprofit, as you guys mm -hmm. are, people uh, need to donate or be involved, volunteer, things of that nature. How can people get involved with Opportunity Place? What can people do to, to come and help you guys? Absolutely. There's a lot of ways. Uh, people can go to our website, which is opifwb.org, and they can either, obviously, we, you know, we're dependent upon the public for funds, mm -hmm. so they can certainly support us in that way. Um, they can volunteer. Uh, you know, we do day of caring with the United Way, so they can come and do a project, or they can come in and tutor our children. We also have a meal donor program, which is really kind of exciting. Yeah, a person, if you like to cook, we have a lot of churches that will do this. They can fix a meal, bring it in, and that way we're able to give a nice, nutritious, hot meal to our residents. Because we always have between 30 and 35 people there at one time. Wow. Um, but if they don't cook, but they still want to support the program, again, they can go to our website, and for $77, Golden Corral will bring a meal over for our family. So for those of you out there who, if you haven't been to Golden Corral and you go, please thank Mark for all of his support. Absolutely. That is fantastic. Uh, uh, so a lot of different opportunities there for Absolutely. people to get involved on a daily basis. But y'all have a great event coming up. Uh, Lee, we do. Uh, we here, do. Here next month in September. So tell me a little bit about what's in store for, uh, for Casino Royale. We're extremely excited. Yeah, Casino Royale uh, is our uh, signature event. Uh, our first one was last year, mm -hmm. and uh, we had over 250 people to that one. Was, everybody loved it. So we're making it bigger and better this year. It's going to be at the Next Level Nightclub on Perry in downtown Fort Walton. Mm -hmm. It's coming up on the 20th of September from 7 to 10 at night. And again, uh, Deborah told you about the website. You can find tickets there. But the exciting thing about this event is, I mean, of course, we're always fundraising. I'm on the board. Sure. We're all volunteers. Sure. And, and we're always looking for somebody's time, their talent, their resources to help make Opportunity Place tick. Mm -hmm. And without the support of, like Cox, you're helping us with some, some of what we're doing now. Mm -hmm. um, those things go a long way to serve in this population that uh, you, can get, you can get excited about it. And this event, uh, we'll be giving away all kinds of gifts. Uh, they have a silent auction, a, a live auction, uh, trips. Uh, it's just a great way to support this worthy cause and have a good time. So Casino Royale, not only the, the auctions and the trips, <coughs> I, I assume there's some card playing. Oh yes, we, right? have, we have hired professional um, 
company that actually takes care of the roulette tables and everything. So it's done professionally. Mm -hmm. And uh, we've got, what, 14 tables? 14 this, tables 14 this year. tables yeah. around. Uh, just, we have a, uh, a wine bottle toss. You throw rings at the wine and get to take the wine oh, out. Wow. It's just a lot of fun. 50-50? Yeah, 50-50 uh, events. So I really encourage uh, people to come. And, mm -hmm. and like I said, you're not only are you going to have a great time, you're also going to be able to support a worthy cause. Absolutely, a great cause and yeah, a great time. So uh, how, where can people get tickets? How do they get the tickets? Uh, and, and give us the date and location again one more time. We're just about yeah. out of time, but I want to make yeah, sure we Yeah, the date again there. was the uh, 20th of September. That's a Friday mm -hmm. uh, from 7 to 10, 10 in the evening. Uh, I'll let you do the ticket part of it. Tickets can be purchased at our website, which is opifwb.org. Um, you can also stop by our office, and we'll have tickets there. And we'll be giving away some at uh, upcoming uh, chamber meetings. So okay, be sure to right. attend those. And if you want to write us a really big check, we'll give you a <laughs> whole that, bunch of tickets, there you too. Go. <laughs> Absolutely. Perfect. Well, Lee and Deborah, thank you both so much for thank coming you. on the program today. I really appreciate it. Yeah. Certainly. Stay with us. When we come back, we'll be joined by the United Way.